government officials and uh, representatives of uh, security organs, the headmistress of Maranyundo Girls School, distinguished friends from uh, Maranyundo Initiative, esteemed parents, staff, teachers and partners, dear students, Dear students of Maranyundo Girls Schools, good afternoon. It is heartwarming to see all of you gathered here today to celebrate our young graduates and inaugurate the new educational facilities symbolizing Maranyundo Girls Schools commitment to pushing the boundaries of knowledge and learning for its students. But first thing first, this is a momentous event for many of you young ladies. So allow me to take a moment to acknowledge your accomplishments and offer hearty congratulatory wishes to the 60 girls graduating from O level and the 57 graduating from A level. Esteemed ladies and gentlemen, how far has Maranyondo School come? Some of you may remember the official opening of this school in uh, 2008, when a group of committed individuals from Rwanda and beyond were pulling ideas and resources together in the hopes of bringing to life our vision for a successful and sustainable institution capable of continuously delivering the kind of achievements seen in the past few years. Others may also have flashbacks to 2014 and the dream to expand the school's infrastructure to accommodate A-level students, a dream soon translated into a 40 million Rwandan francs fundraiser held by parents which turned into this beautiful reality. And today, in keeping with the same vision to offer the best learning platform to the girls, thanks to the concerted efforts of parents, diverse sponsors, and the Maranyundo Initiative, this school is now revealing its newest knowledge center. Distinguished audience, Rwanda is among a is, is among a number of countries that have uh, given due importance to education. That is because we profoundly understand its power to build an edified nation, one in which human beings are at the heart of policies and where the right settings will allow individuals to thrive and lead the country towards higher horizons. And as a result, not only do we focus on making education accessible, to all in primary and secondary school, but we also emphasize the value of learning about a range of subjects from so social studies to STEM. And as a matter of fact, you may already know that our country has put at the forefront of its priority efforts to promote gender equality across all fields. As such, our commitment to advocate for girls' education has over the years led to a steady growth in the enrollment of girls and women in educational institutions. At the same time, as mentioned earlier, we concentrated on improving the, on improving the presence of girls in the STEM fields. So last year's figure of 41,543 girls enrolled in the STEM-focused secondary schools was invigorating, though we continue to monitor its steady increase since it's in the government plans to triple the number of girls pursuing TVET. Uh, for those who don't know, it's a technical and vocational education and training, most importantly in the field of STEM by the year 2020. Distinguished guests, I must say that uh, our shared philosophy on the importance of girls' education I'm honored to see that the partnership between the Maranyondo Girls School and my foundation, Imbuto, 
has been able to empower several girls through opportunities to pursue a well-rounded education. To my great delight, we have had quite a number of girls broadening their path to success and rewarded as the best performing girls while they attended Maranyundu Girls School. In the last few years, for example, out of the 4,400 4, girls rewarded nationally by the foundation, we have had up to 40 best performing girls. We refer to them as the BPGs in this school, in addition to another 20 students who, receive, who received scholarships for Maranyondo School under Imbuto Edified Generation Program. Babyei, mwe mwagize amahirwe yo kurerera muri iri shuri mumfashe dushimire umuryango wa bene bikira badufashije kurerera urwanda uyu munsi ishuri rikaba ryatumurikiye imfura zaryo Hashize imyaka 7 umuryango wa bene bikira weguriwe rino shuri mu nshingano bihaye zo guteza imbere uburezi n'uburere bw'umwana w'umukobwa bamaze bamaze kugera kuri byinshi harimo n'inyubako twamurikiwe uno munsi nubwo dufite byinshi twishimira mu iterambere ry'uburezi haraho ugisanga imyumvire iri hasi aho abana batishuri batararangiza n'amashuri abanza ibi birababaje ariko bitume twibaza icyo dukwiye gukora nk'ababyeyi ndetse nk'abarezi babyeyi kwigisha abana bacu ni wo murage nyawo dukwiye kubasigira ntibikwiye ko bava mu ishuri batarangije byibura amashuri yisumbuye munyemerere twongere twiha intego yo yo kukundisha abana ishuri tubibutse ko kwiga abyo bizabafasha guhangana n'umuvuduko w'isi dutuye ndetse bikanabaha nubasha bwo gutegura ejo heza hazaza no kuba ababyeyi beza bazarerera urwanda distinguished friends from maranyondo initiative our past has taught us many lessons about the power of good friendships in terms of adversity and in terms of uh, joy. We are truly grateful for the interest you have shown in our country and your continued investment over the years for the well-being of our people. Your dedication and unrelenting support towards the balanced education provided at Maranyondo Girls School is laying out a sound foundation on which our girls will stand to build a strong future for themselves and our goal, global communities at large. You've been there since the beginning and you've helped create what we are celebrating here today. Indeed, your special care towards our girls will forever be at the heart of this school and our communities. Thank you for your compassion and thank you for the optimism. <laughs> Dear graduates, as you begin a new stage in your lives, always look back with gratitude, but also inspiration to this school and its staff, to your classmates and the many lessons you provided to refine your academic growth. And all the while, be ready to take part in our nation's quest for peace, stability, and socioeconomic su success. I feel great joy and pride when I look at you today, thinking about the boundless opportunities that lie ahead of you. Do not worry. The dedication and resilience you've had to show at different times in this journey at Maranyondo School will greatly serve you as you know now set your sights on materializing your goals and dreams. It is my hope that the strong ties that make, that make this school 
what it is, that the Maranyundo spirit of uh, togetherness, as uh, Sister Juvenal said it, has given you a sense of belonging, a sisterhood that transcends time and space, will keep you grounded and connected to one another, to those future students who will follow in your footsteps. Distinguished graduating class of 2017, I ask you to never cease seeking greater accomplishments, be they in academia, in the social, or the professional world. Be the footsteps that guide your sisters, the footsteps that have helped push this school to its ranking as one of the top best girls' school in the country. It's your responsibility to keep this flame, this drive, this hunger for high academic performance alive. And my hope is that years from now, you'll remember these words. Be bold in the choices you make. Do not be afraid of making mistakes, for oftentimes they teach us great lessons about ourselves. Most importantly, go forth with your, with your lives, not afraid of the greatness you are capable of reaching. And now, as I conclude my remarks, I would like you to make a minute to look at the proud faces surrounding you today, your parents, the teachers, your peers, and friends of Maranyundo who came from near and far to be with you on this special day. In many ways, these people are the reason why you are here today celebrating a milestone in your lives. Remember as well that education holds the power to change the world and this is even more applicable to you because of the blessings of a solid education and caring heart nurtured by the Benevichira sisters. I urge you to continue sharpening these tools you have been given so you can use them for the benefit of this global village that we live in. I wish you all the best in your future endeavors and again, congratulations to you all. I thank you for your kind attention. <laughs>